Breaking right now, a murder suspect is dead after an hours-long standoff with federal and county law enforcement. The first alert breaking news tracker is at the scene right now. Atlanta News First, Don Shipman, live outside the hotel where this happened in Rockdale County. Good morning, Don. Good morning to both of you. And yeah, this was definitely a tense situation and the standoff lasted hours with law enforcement here on the scene taking on gunfire. And I want you to take a look because you can see where this all unfolded right here outside and inside of this extended stay hotel. We're in Conyers and I kind of want to give you an idea of where we are. We're in the area where there are a number of hotels or some restaurants here. We're just off of I-20. And now take a look at this video from last night and overnight. A lot of law enforcement here on the scene. Here's what authorities say happened. The Rockdale County Sheriff's Office says that its SWAT team entered this hotel. It's the Horizon Extended Stay on Iris Drive here, where the murder suspect had barricaded himself inside this happening over the course of several hours. Once they got inside, they found that he had died by suicide. Now we're told that the U.S. Marshals Southeastern Fugitive Unit was here to serve a felony murder warrant for a suspect out of a case out of Crawford County. Now during this standoff, shots were fired at deputies and one was actually hit with debris. Authorities are describing that debris as sheetrock or wallboard from the actual building. That deputy, we're told, is going to be okay. No other law enforcement members were hurt and there are no reports of anyone else being injured. At this point, it's still, still under investigation and this case has been turned over to the U.S. Marshal's Office for continued investigation. We're live here in Conyers. Don Shipman, Atlanta News First.